Let me give you one little picture of Jerusalem in closing. Turn to Revelation 21, verse 16. The book of Revelation is full of pictures. And here is a beautiful picture. The whole book is full of symbols. And here is a beautiful symbol, 2116. It says here that the city, which is a picture of the church, is laid out as a square. Length is as great as its width. And the height, the length and width and height are equal. Now, I wonder how I can illustrate that. The length and width and height are equal. So here, let me... I wasn't prepared for this. Okay, here is something, it's a square, hopefully. Length and width are equal. But if you don't know the depth of this, I could fool you that it is a cube. If you want to know whether it's a cube or not, I've got to turn it around and show you that it's got no depth. This is religious Christianity. No depth. Big. All that God has to do in the final day is just turn us around, show people how much depth you have. And they'll get a shock. Was that all there was in your life? Paper thin? Depth to your Christianity? But it doesn't matter if you're not a big square. Supposing you're only this size, much smaller, be a cube. Or you're even smaller than that, small square, but be a cube. Let there be as much depth as impression you give to others of your spirituality. Otherwise, you're a hypocrite. You're religious. You won't be a part of Jerusalem. Every stone that fits in Jerusalem is going to be a cube. There's nobody like this that's going to be without depth. That's why it's important, brothers and sisters, to live before God, to have depth in your private life before God as much as the impression you give. Don't give a bigger impression before people when there's only thinness in your depth in your life then give a smaller impression to people about your spirituality because then at least you'll be a cube. So start with depth. If your depth is one inch, make sure your square is also one inch. You present yourself to people not as a great mighty man or woman of God. No, I'm only this much. That's all the depth I have. You'll be part of Jerusalem. You don't have to be big, but you have to be a cube. You have to be honest. I hope you've learned something today.